hi, I gotta make this fast because it's 100 plus degrees in the valley today and I don't want to become a puddle. Here I am in my car making a video by myself, which makes me a real YouTuber now. YouTube, you don't really know me yet very well, but I already love you. So I went to the Melrose Trading Post today, which I talked about in one of my earlier blogs. But I got a bunch of random photographs that I'll talk to you about later. But I just really quickly wanted to say that I've just been euphorically happy lately. I've just been in such a state of bliss and I want to sing all the time. And there's no reason for it except that just I'm loving life. So spread some love today. Hi, I wanted to record a video, but I don't know if you can hear me over these super loud fountains. See these fountains? They're so loud! So now I'm out here um, looking at the street with my expensive computer. Because my roommates were all sleeping inside, I didn't want to wake them up because I'm a wonderful roommate. So then I decided to come outside and record in the bushes here. Okay, the quality of this isn't any better. I look like a dead person. There's no... There's just, it's spooky. Oh, but it's October, so it's fine that I'm spooky. So let's be honest, I thought I'd be a lot more famous by now. So far I have four views, four of which were me. So that's weird, internet. Um, let's work on that. So I went to the Melrose Trading Post today, which I've posted about before on my film blog. If you ever want to see that, it's SundanceCat at blogspot.com. And it was 100 plus degrees, but I had to go pick up a birthday present for a friend. So I showed you these photos earlier, but I want to show you them up close now. I had a friend compliment me once on how often I can use the word meow instead of now. She was like, that's really cool the way you do it so naturally. So I got all these random stickers and free stuff and then all these things. And everything else here is a present for my friend, so I'll just show you these photos. So this person has this booth at the Melrose Trading Post in West Hollywood where they sell these random photographs from like garage sales and stuff that they've collected and I really, really love it a lot. Sorry, I thought someone was coming and I was like, don't mug me. So this is a photo that was taken in 1952 of Michael and the dog Rhett, which I just think is so wonderful. This little boy just, it was the 50s. Think how old he is now. This is just him with this dog Rhett. I think how old Rhett is now. Okay, someone is definitely like watching me from the window. Ah! Okay, here is this bridal party and it's this woman's wedding day and she didn't even open her eyes and then I assume these are her maids of honor and that one's like on the phone. She's like, sorry, don't got time for this wedding. This is this little girl and maybe her grandmother. I don't know. That's the great thing about this is you don't know anything about these people. You can just make it up. This could be the best or worst day of this little girl's life. We'll never know, will we? It looks like the Huntington Gardens. This photo looks like it was taken in the 20s. Look at these people. I just love them. There's a baby randomly just chilling in the garden. This is Marilyn at eight months old. That's actually written on the back. That's not something I made up. I could make up something. Here's Marilyn in the garden with her favorite tractor toy. She's learning to till the fields. Oh, someone just drove by awkwardly. <sighs> oh gosh, this is not safe. But I'm doing it for you guys, my viewers, AKA me. My last one. These are these women. I don't know, I just love them so much. Look how, oh gosh, it keeps getting dark. Look how cool these women are. What brought them together? This woman's not smiling. I don't know, maybe that's just how she is. Oh, Ruth, incorrigible. She was probably the scampiest of them all. She like didn't smile for the photo and everyone's like, oh, Ruth. On another note, I just wanted to talk about how happy I've been. Also, I've been chewing on a cough drop this whole time. I'm sorry, I, I think I'm getting ill because I've been singing so much because I've been so happy lately for no reason. I don't know, I just am happy. Are you guys happy? It's really nice to be happy, especially when it's just for no reason. It's just like, Complete happiness all the time. Like today I was just like, la 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 la, like skipping around work. But anyways, I tried to dance, but I remembered I'm facing the street and people are watching. Psych, I'm back. I never knew this part of my apartment existed. It's so cool. The people on this side of my apartment complex have like 
patio furniture and chairs and it doesn't even look stolen or from the garbage like most of my furniture. Anyways, yeah, I just want to say it's good to be happy. I feel a lot since I've moved to California, I've been so intent on like, what am I doing and what does my life mean? And I've just really been trying to look at like what makes me happy and do those things. Like I'm learning guitar, I'm making a YouTube, I swim every day, I go reading. Who knows what I'll do next? Hot air ballooning maybe? I've just been doing a lot of crafts and having fun and enjoying my life, which is kind of nice. So I recommend you do it as well. I think this cough drops expired. Fun fact about me, I don't believe in Western medicine. Somewhat. Like if someone's really suffering and they need medicine, that's great, take it. But I've been very blessed that I don't have too many aches or pains, so I, I really don't use too much medicine. But for the most part, I think we're super over-medicated here in America. <gasps> there goes the light. It's back. Yeah, so most of the medicine that I take is very like natural. I just don't take a lot of medicine, I guess. So then the few things that I do own that's like medicine is all expired. So how about you comment what makes you happy? Because comments would make me happy today. Oh, screw it. I just decided to come back in. I don't wake my roommates up, but it's safer in here. And there's a turkey. Also, I don't know who bought these, but there are these really beautiful roses. Isn't this nice? Maybe I'll just sit like this. Oh my gosh, they smell nice too. I don't know who bought these. Maybe a secret admirer. So I just wanted to say three things that are making me happy today. Number one, I got free food from work. Yay! Mm, oh my gosh, I should just sleep on these. Wouldn't that be nice? Number two is that joy has been really easy for me lately, which I just keep catching myself off guard having fun and dancing and singing. It's really nice. Number three is that it's October and I have a different outfit for every day of October. Here's today's outfit. Anyways, meow.